Hi students, this is Alex here. And the question is solve d square minus 6d plus 13 into y equal to 0. The so first step we have to write the auxiliary equation where we write capital D as small m. So m square minus 6m plus 13 equal to 0. Here the product is 13, sum is minus 6. It is not possible to factor rise. So since we are not able to factorize this, we go for using the quadratic equation formula. So here the equation is in terms of m. So m is equal to minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac whole divided by 2a. And the values of a, b, c are nothing but the coefficient of m square, m and the constant term. So a is 1, b is minus 6 and c is 13. By substituting this, we get m is equal to minus b, which is 6, plus or minus root of b square, minus 6 whole square is 36, minus 4a c, whole divided by 2a, so 2 into 1. Then after this, we have the first term 6, then plus or minus root of when I multiply these two, we get 52. Then 36 minus 52, which is minus 16. So inside the square root, we have minus, and this is nothing but 6 plus or minus root of 16 is 4. Since there is a minus, we put 4i divided by 2. And we can take 2 common. So 3 plus or minus 2i divided by 2, we can cancel this. So we got the values of m and it is of the form alpha plus or minus i beta. By comparing this, we come to know the value of alpha is 3 and beta is 2. And in this case, where we get a complex value, the complementary function is nothing but e power alpha x. Let me write the formula e power alpha x then c1 cos beta x plus c2 sin beta x. By placing the value of alpha and the beta, we get e power 3x into c1 cos 2x plus c2 sin 2x. We have no particular integral because the other side is 0. Therefore, the solution is y is equal to cf plus pi. So, now the solution is only the complementary function e power 3x into c1 cos 2x plus c2 sin 2x.